What's up you guys, Team Team Rose and we are back at you with another video. You know who I am, Kami, accompanying me as always, Jack. How are we doing today, buddy? We are getting a little uh, tricksy, getting a little uh, pranky, because we back, baby. We, we back, baby. As you see from the title of the video, it is a video we did on the Legacy of the Duelist, Link Evolutions, it is Prank Kids. Okay, here we go. Going first, you know how it is. First off, we got Dropsies in hand, Roxies in hand. We got the Thunder King in hand. We got Called by the Grave and Prank Kids Place in hand. Let's do this. All right, so sir, we're gonna start off by laying our place. Our place going to activate. We're gonna get uh, our fancies in hand. We are going to go ahead and link off Roxy's into da, 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 the prank kids meow meow mew with meow or with Roxy's in graveyard. We go oh they're gonna ash blossom Roxy's okay okay we're gonna call by grave that freaking ash blossom get that out of my duel <laughs> spit on you so call by the grave activates gun negate the ash blossom as we all know strong strat and Roxy's activates which we are going to go ahead and pick our uh, thunder dragon king to <laughs> pitch and we're going to go ahead and link off into doodle doodle do doodle 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 and then uh you know uh lamp Seas is going to go ahead and activate in graveyard along with our doodle do we are going to go ahead and draw a card going drawing into prank kids pandemonium pretty solid pretty solid they're gonna take 500 points of damage while we play our uh, fansies and they're going we're gonna go ahead and Fusion Summon in hand into Weather Washer. Strong first play. Oh my god, we are freaking cracked right now. Dropsies and Fancies is going to activate from Graveyard, activating our place. And uh, what, what happens here? Ooh. Let's say, are we gain attack? We gain life points, and then we get our Roxies on the field, and we go ahead and get Dropsies on the field as well. And we're we're not done yet. We're gonna link off again into a link four, rip roaring rooster. How you like that? Link four first turn. I bet I bet you uh Ooh. bet you dry drytron can't do that. Oh, they're gonna regeki. We're gonna weather wash that. No. Also, we're gonna activate some effects from the graveyard. Now, Jack, tell me uh, tell me some uh, some good things about weather washer here. Uh. Well, you see, we got a tribute and we got two cards back. Oh. And everything died. And everything died. <laughs> so they're 
So there's nothing good about Weather Washer. Gotcha. <laughs> uh, none of them. No, I say Weather Washer is good for negating uh, damage and effect damage. But we're going to go ahead and Harpy's Feather Dust that backfield. Get out of here. So we, we may or may not have blew a load, but the thing is, though, we're still sitting pretty good because it's, it is prank kids. Prank kids can pop off on a dime. I mean, it's big one of them, man. You can't really. King can't, can't, can't do anything. Yeah. So they do, from the looks of it, they are running Constellars. It is Constellar a, Knights. It's actually, it's actually something that's rare to see. We're going to go ahead and Ash Blossom their reinforcement. Now, is this a is this a pure Constellar deck they're running? Or do, what is um, it? My knowledge, yeah, it was a pure, it was a pure go seller deck. Okay, okay. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and affect that damage with our evolution. You know, draw a call by the grave. Not what we want to see, but it is good to have. Better to have it than not need it than to need it and not have it. So that's true. So they're going to go ahead and increase Constellar by one. They're going to bring out Syat, going for it. That do, 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 that XZ's play. Going into Constellar Ptolemy M7. M7 is a bit of a pain in the butt, I'm not even gonna lie. They put our Ash back into our hand to do damage. Yeah. Um, I don't know if that was the best play on their part. Uh, seeing as an Ash Blossom, probably not. We did draw a Thunder Dragon Fusion. Uh, that's a big oof for them. We're gonna go ahead and put cards back into our deck for the Fusion Summon. And we're gonna get Prank Kids Battling Butley. It's a big oof for them. 3,500, and M7's gonna go to the graveyard. And uh, we in turn. Yeah, it's very nice. Now, like I said, Prank Kids, it does pop off on a dime when it when you get the right cards. And uh, since you put an Ash back into our hand, we're not gonna the game. <laughs> yeah, you know, that, that Ash Blossom play definitely came back to bite him in the butt. So now it comes our turn. We are going to draw in two... Our monster reborn. That's even a bigger oof for him. Uh, we're gonna grab M7. No, <laughs> that that's a very good. Uh, that's a very good play. Grabbing M7, bringing it to our side of the field. You're gonna get free damage here and a big whopping 35 hundo. Big hundo, hundy. <laughs> 35 hundy, hundy. So now we're sitting pretty good. They're going to go ahead and activate their Alatar. Oh, Star Seller. Okay, Star Seller Knight. They're going to bring out their another Star Seller. And they're, I kind of figured they were going to link. Star Seller is a very big link deck, I will say that. Ooh, Dark Teller. Ooh. It did get rid of our Battle and Boxer, you bastard. No, we, we, we tribute our card to Board Wipe him. Oh, oh, we tributed to Board Wipe. Oh, okay. Direct attack, get the hell out of my duel. I spit on you. So really, the, the thing that lost on the duel was their own card. <laughs> yeah, that is all. <laughs> Next duel. So this is our turn to play. As you can see, we do... Oh, we have a big, big hand of spell cards. We have a Rageki, a Polly... A call by the grave, a prank kids, pranks, and triple tactics talent. Ooh. Okay. Now I'm gonna say we're looking at this hand and we're like, oof, pretty hey, much. Right? Oof. So I'm gonna give you a quick spoiler. We're facing heroes. Oh. And I want you to know we were able to outplay these people so hard. They went through every single hero card in their deck. And we won. Oh. Alright, I want to see this. Right, so they're going to start off their turn with Vision. Or no, Ferris. Ferris, I'm sorry. That's Ferris, not Vision. Let's see. Now there, there's there's Increase. Yeah, we're going to see some uh, common uh, hero plays here. Like, uh, Let's say as you guys might have seen in uh, our Heroes video. Right. They're going to go into Vion, grabbing Stratus. So they're bringing Stratus out onto the field. They're gonna go ahead and add another vision or another monster to their deck. They're gonna go ahead and activate. Here I have that polymerization, like a good hero deck should. Oh, that is a that is a ooh ooh. They have they have it on board. That is a malicious malicious bane. Oh, they're gonna go into Cross Crusader. They're gonna link into Cross Crusader, which Cross Crusader is gonna activate, bringing out another Destiny Hero malicious. 
which gonna get rid of it for a Honest Neos. That is a problem. Honest Neos is a problem. So now they're gonna go ahead and activate Poly Polymerization into the Sunrise. They are for sure blowing their load on this first play here. Then they're gonna use Liquid and Graveyard as long, along with Sunrise. Okay, okay, they're gonna draw a card. They're gonna draw into their Mir Miracle Fusion. Smart play, smart play. Liquid Soldier's gonna activate. They're gonna get some cards. They're gonna go ahead and activate Mass Change. Bringing out their Mass Hero Dark Law, the most troublesome of the Mass Heroes, in my opinion. Fusion Destiny, okay, they're gonna activate Fusion Destiny. Gonna go ahead and bring out. I did. I can't say that card. <laughs> Now they're gonna act yeah just, yeah that that word. Now they're gonna double activate effects. I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of their cross crusader. Gonna deal us some damage, and they're gonna send a card. Turn change. That was actually a uh, that was actually a f oh god we drew into another poly. Oh god. They are gonna go ahead and bring out uh, their draw hand. Which they are popping. They they uh, this is they are popping. They are popping pretty hard. But we're gonna rig a key. Ragaki changes the battlefield. They're gonna max C. They're gonna get some extra cards. No problem. They're gonna need it. Say so we could uh, we could use a max C as well. Uh, drawing some extra cards at this point in time would be very good. Say so we're gonna go ahead and pitch Pandemonium to get a token. Oh god. Oh god. A lot of things are happening. If we played Triple Tactics Talent uh, because they played a monster effect, we can just draw two cards. Right. Triple Tactics Talent. I forgot about that card. Say so we do have two. Oh. We have two Thunder Dragons at hand, and we activated a poly. Thunder Dragon Colossus. Now this makes it where they cannot search cards. They have to draw into them. Right, right. Which I, I feel like shuts down a hero deck pretty good. They are going to go ahead and bring out their increase back to the battlefield. And it's going to turn, uh, pass turn. Now that is a hero lives. They're going to go ahead and lose life points to grab a hero card. Increase is going to come back onto the field. Increase effect activates, which brings out Vion. They are going to link back into their Cross Crusader. Now, hold on. Everybody might be wondering right now, why are they able to search some cards because of, uh, you know, because of Thunder Dragon Colossus? Jack, why are they able to search some cards right now? Uh, because they're not searching into their hand. They're putting it onto the field. Okay. So, now that that explanation is out of the way, the Cross Crusader activates effect. We're going to call by the grave Cross Crusader's effect, and we're going to be like, mm. They have to negate the one on the field. Yep. We're going to be like, mm, get the hell out of here. They are going to activate Miracle Fusion, which they're going to go ahead and banish cards to get a fusion monster out onto the field. And they're going to... Ooh, absolute zero. Okay. Okay, that's a, that's definitely a game changer. They're going to grab more cards. They're going to activate another fusion destiny. Oh, my God. I see what you... I can already see what you mean by you... They are at 12 cards in their in their deck. But they did get. Uh, they do have dangerous out on the field. Dangerous does over does top our Colossus, but we're gonna activate Colossus effect, which we pitch a Thunder Dragon to keep it on the field. They set one and pass. Now, what do we got in response here, Jackie boy? We draw into a Fancy, and we're gonna go straight. We're gonna go straight into battle phase. They're gonna honest Neos it. No problem. We're gonna. Uh, you know, we're gonna lose some life points. We're gonna pitch another Thunder Dragon to keep our Thunder Dragon Colossus on the field. And we're going to set a Fancy. Now, Dangerous doesn't get destroyed. And uh, now the field's looking pretty uh, pretty good. But wait! They are going to Link Summon. Yeah, Three. They're going to activate uh, um, Absolute Zero's effect to board wipe us. Mm -hmm. And the Imperma, so we can't keep our Dragon out. Uh, I mean, I mean that's a, that's a, that, is a smart, that is a smart play. That really it was, is. It was, it was a really good one. They're gonna hit us for some this is where I was sitting here like, oh my lord. We are at 600 life points, and we draw into a triple tactic talent. Okay. So and I am so happy for what happens here. <laughs> we're gonna go into rock. We're gonna play Roxy. Go into meow meow. Uh, Roxy's effect activates. They're going to Ash Blossom. Oh, they Ash Which Blossom. Which is a monster effect. And what we did, we learned earlier about triple tactic talents. <laughs> We get to get extra cards onto the field. Yes, and we can also take their card. Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah, with the, oh, 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 oh. So, he, uh, forbidden droplets, so you, it's only half damage here. But, uh, there is no way we're letting him keep his card. No. We're gonna link. <laughs> oh, God, we're gonna link in a Nightmare Phoenix. 
<laughs> Triple tech. Or, uh, that's, uh, uh, Prank Kids Pranks. Activates. Getting, uh, we're gonna go ahead and shuffle some cards back into our deck and draw one. Yep. And now right here, it's like, okay. What else does he have? And we're like, okay. Oh, here that's the same. And... And they surrender. Because <laughs> literally there's he, nothing else they could do. He had no search off of Stratos, which means he had zero hero cards left in his deck. Oh, that's... That's that's rough. That's what happens when you blow your load way too much. And there you have it. That is the Prank Kids Master Duels Edition deck. Oof. Now, I will say this Prank Kids deck, from what I've seen, it pops a lot better than that uh, Legacy of the Duelist deck does. I'm just saying. But, uh, Jack, how much fun did you actually have with the Prank Kids deck? Um, Really fun. Uh, this is a really fun deck. I really liked the... Uh... Thunder Dragon Spice that we threw into this deck. Yeah, I, I will say that. I uh, say with Dra uh, Thunder Dragon Colossus, that did uh, did help out quite a bit. I will say. Yeah, it was uh, really really fun to see. Um, I mean, there's a lot of times you don't see the card, but I mean, well, but when you do, it's like just a really fun experience that you know to play with this deck again. Yeah, plus with with I feel like with Prank Kids, people aren't gonna they're they're not expecting the Thunder Dragon play. I feel um, like I, I feel like the Thunder yeah. Dragon play really does throw them off. It definitely really helps out. It's definitely uh really good. Definitely, if you're facing a deck that likes to put cards into their hand. <laughs> Freaking oh oh hell what is it uh oh brain not working. Any deck of master duels. I will just put it that way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but uh, with that said, you guys, thank you so much for tuning in to this video. Well, don't forget to like, comment on the video how much you loved this video, and if you have any recommendations or requests for us to do a deck. And while you're here, do not forget to subscribe. It's free, you'll get to see the juiciest content on the YouTubes from us. And uh, I'm Kami, he's Jack, and we're Team Team Rose, guys, and we will catch you in the next video. Peace. Bye-bye. I think the girls with their nails done now.